Hey guys, Natural J and welcome back. Um, you know there's anything different. Got a background. Um, I was saving. Um, I got a background stand. I just brought some fabric from the fabric store. And I have new lights as well. So I'm super excited to be filming with new backgrounds and just better lighting. So bear with me as I try to get everything together and get the lighting situated and all that stuff. So um, I'm currently in my living room filming because this is the only space in the house that all this can fit. So Hopefully someday I'll have my own room so I can film in there and just have everything all together. So um, today I'm bringing you my June Birch Box of Ipsy. So let's jump right into it. First we're going to start with Ipsy and this is the bag it came in this month. I think it was Rebel was the theme. And I like how it's like the old school graffiti art all over it. I really, really love it. It's really, really cute and colorful and just, um, just a really cute bag. Great for summer. So... First thing in here is this Urban Decay Lounge Eyeshadow, and this is in the color, I don't know what color this is. <laughs> um, let me see if I open it. It's the, oh, the 20th birthday, and they're giving us one of their iconic shades. Oh, it actually changes color, it's saying. So this, to me, it looks like, like a iridescent like bluish green color if you can see that um i'm very excited to give this a try um maybe it's like a mood changing thing i have to look more into this because literally i just got my boxes peered into them and then decided to film so um <laughs> hopefully i will update you guys in my shopping my beauty samples um series next up is this boo boo cover up concealer um and this is in i don't see the shade on here so this is like a concealer. I've seen this. Other people have gotten this in their Ipsy bags, so I finally have one now. This looks like my shade of concealer that I would wear, like for under my eyes. Yeah, this looks like my color of concealer in a way. Maybe a little light, so, but I've heard a lot of great things about it that it's very full coverage and it covers up anything, so I'm really excited to give this a try. Next up was something I was super excited to see. It's this ColourPop Cream Gel Liner in the color Swerve. I'll take it out the box for you. I've been seeing this all over the place. I've been wanting to get my hands on these, but I'm trying to be good, not overspending. So um, here is the cream gel liner. And I think this is like a blue. No, this is a black. I'm sorry. It's like a really dark matte black color. So I can really put this to use. And it was very smooth going on the back of my hand. So I cannot wait to use this. Next up is this Be A Bombshell. Um lip gloss and this is in the color secret it's like a really pretty like pinkish nude color and this is not open sorry guys um let me see if i can do it open okay it's open so it's like a pretty pinkish like mauve color this is pretty it's what the swatch of that looks like um i probably have to pair this with a brown lip liner in order to wear it but it's really pretty really like looks like something i would wear so i can't wait to try this out and the last thing in my Ipsy is this Frank Body Original Body Scrub. And this is a coffee scrub. Um, I've never tried a coffee scrub before. Well, I've made my own, but I've never, like, tried one before. So I've heard they're really, really great for exfoliating your skin and leaving it, like, nice and soft and smooth and everything. So I cannot wait to give this a try. So that was everything in Ipsy. Let's jump into Birch Box. And here is the box that came in. It's really pretty colorful, like, pattern with all the colors in it. I really, really like it. It's cute. So first thing in here is something I was excited to see. It's the Benefit Brow Collection. It's the first exclusive look. And I got Guinea Brow in the color 3. I already have the original Guinea Brow. Um, I have it in medium deep and I really, really love it. So I'm guessing they're reformulating it and repackaging it. So this is what the cute packaging looks like. Um, I normally use this like when I'm not... Well, I'm in a rush to do my brows. I don't have time to sit there and really comb out and glue my brows. I just, like, brush this on. I have to add a little bit up front, and I am good to go. If I can give you guys a swatch here. Um, I don't know if you can really see that. This may be a little too light. I'm not sure. I have to give it a try because the one I have is dark. Um, so, hopefully this works with my brows. But I love giving me brow anywhere. I can't wait to see what the new formula is like. Next up is this um, Orbrie Perfume. You guys know I love getting perfume samples. 
Um, this one has um, bergamot, white butterfly, white butterfly jasmine, and warm sandalwood. So it seems like it's a floral warm scent, which is, I love warm floral scents. So I can't wait to try this out. Next up is this Kula um, Radical Recovery After Sun Lotion. So I guess you use this after you've been out in the sun. Um, yeah, you apply it after you've been in the sun for your face and your body. It really helps replenish, renews, renews, and moisturizes your skin after you've been out at the beach all day or just been out when it's really, really hot because it's summer now, officially. And um, it's really, really hot outside, so you really want to protect your skin from the sun. Next up is this um, Emo Logi. I probably butchered the name. This is the Intense, Intense Blemish Serum. I think I received a moisturizer or a facial wash by this company. I really, really love them. Um, use this after cleansing your face and you dab a small amount onto spots, pimples, scars, or discoloration areas. and Or you apply over your face and you repeat day and night. So um, I have been breaking up a little bit, um, but not as much. So and I am getting like... I have gotten some dark acne scars from some of my pimples, so this would be really great to help, you know, fade those out and everything, so I can't wait to give this a try. And lastly is this Parlor Shampoo Moisturizing Repair, and I'm wondering why I just have a shampoo and not a conditioner, because normally when I get a brush box with a shampoo, it's a matching conditioner, but this time around, there's no conditioner, so um, this is for weightless height. It's weightless hydration for strong, shiny hair. It is sulfate-free, paraben-free, gluten-free, cruelty-free, safe for color-free hair. So I guess I will put this to you since I know it's sulfate-free. <laughs> so that was everything in my June Birchbox and Ipsy. What did you guys get this month? And until next time, see you guys later.